better accomplished stage person than I am, uh, Miss Kelly Lightborn. Miss <laughs> Lightborn is multi-talented and multifaceted. She's a television personality, an attorney, a motivational speaker. She holds a Juris Doctor and Master's Degree in Marriage and Family Therapy. Uh, I'm, I should be standing over here right now. Mm -hmm. uh, oh. she's, the, there we she's go. also the 2009 tenor. I've never been to, to, uh, 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 to Miss Florida before. Miss Miss Florida, 2011 Mrs. North America and Mrs. Galaxy International 2012. Uh, she's the host of Consumer Update on ABC Action News. It keeps going. Um, and she appears nationally on Lifetime Television's Designing Spaces and has been featured on shows like E! Entertainment, Mari, uh, Animal Planet, and Extra. She's also a busy philanthropist, and she's going to tell you a little bit more about that, but she is a founder of the National Humane Society and Teen Edge, which urges youth to have, to have a live with power attitude, and that's what we're about here today. We want you to live with power. We want you to bring this into the future, and we want you guys to make the world a better place. And I'm going to hand off to Kelly. She's going to tell you a little bit more about what she does, and we'll get the show going for you. Say, before I do that, though, I think we need to give Terry for pulling this together a round of applause. Before we do anything, she's not worthy. I'm not worthy. You are awesome. You are awesome. I mean, it's incredible that she brought all these incredible minds in one place. And when I was asked to be a speaker, I'll be honest with you, I didn't know much about TED. I'd heard about it, but I really had no idea the depth that they go to, to share ideas. It's kind of cool, right? Wake up. Wake up. Try it again. It's kind of cool, right? Pretty cool. Am I the only one that has my caffeine this morning? I think so. Anyway, so when she asked me to do this, like I said, I, I got really excited when I learned about it. And the first thing I did, as soon as those speakers went up, I started researching. They got some pretty cool people. Today is going to be a day full of ideas, full of passion, and what I really hope is that it inspires everybody to love it and do it. Because everybody in here, even, even all the people that are speaking that have all these accomplishments, I'm sure there is something in the back of your mind that you go, gosh, I would love to do that. But, how many of you guys have buts in your life? I got them. Even with that long laundry list of things, I got buts in my life. And but, so I'm hoping today that we can inspire just from the people standing up here to get rid of those butts and take action. So let me tell you guys about my vision, because that's what it is. It's about spreading our visions, spreading our great ideas. So obviously I do a lot. About 2008, I became a mom. And any moms out here know immediately what does your life do? It goes full circle. Everything that was important isn't important, and now your family's important, your kids are important. And so I started looking at things different. At that time, I was a reporter, so I was in the middle of the newsroom. How many people could feel, if you're in the middle of the newsroom, how many of you guys couldn't even click off the news? Right? Imagine if it's your work every day. I couldn't click off. I would try, and they're like, live in five seconds. I'm like, oh, God, I don't want to do this. Because I didn't love what I do because it wasn't spreading joy. So when I had my kids, and I sat there and looked, and I thought, I'm so tired of hearing these stories about teenagers that do this, and teenagers that do this, and it's all negative. And I said, I have to do something about it, because if I'm not doing something about it, I'm part of the problem. And that was when Teen Edge was born. And that became my passion, was sharing a vision, and sharing this vision of teenagers, of our youth, of not as these negative things that eventually they'll grow out of, but as this prime opportunity in life that they can grow that they can do whatever they want. And if one of her I got to talk to her. She's pretty cool, so if you get a break, Bentley, you guys gotta, gotta talk to her. <laughs> Not meaning to put you on the spot or anything. But anyway, so that was what my vision was about. It was about highlighting all the, the teens in here, all the young adults that are doing great things, and then inspire other teens to not have excuses. Because so many of them go, well, I can't do this because I don't know about you, but I ate chicken noodle soup my teenage years to a single mom. I can tell you, I didn't have enough money. But I didn't let that stop me. So what is the difference between all the people that got up this morning, because it's Saturday morning, at 1010, and came in here, and those other people that sit home? What's the difference? To 
taking an action. It's one thing. It's this right here. It's one thought. I actually ran into somebody last night because I was doing some news stuff. Um, and it, it was an old person that I kind of had knew. He was in the newsroom. And I sat there and I went, so what do you want to do? Because I was so inspired because I was coming here. So I've, all week I've been going, what do you want to do? Do you do it? Love it. What do you want to do? And they're going, wow, I cannot wait to see this streaming live video because <laughs> I'm already passionate about it. And all he says to me is, I would love to travel all across the U.S. and video sports teams. And he's got no family, no kids, no anything. And he looked at me and he says, you were supposed to be here at this minute because I'm going to go apply tonight. There was nothing different about him. He's skilled. He's been skilled for, well, he's been at the station in Tampa for since 2004. What changed? His thought. And what created that chain of chain reaction because of me being here and sharing that. So I thank you for that. So I got a question. I got five dollars. Who wants to who wants to buy my five dollars for a dollar? Who wants to buy my five dollars for a dollar? Hello, look up. Five dollars for a dollar. No takers. Five dollars for one dollar. First person to the stage. Come on, 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 come on. Oh, here we go, taker. Now, get, give me my buck back. That works. So what did he just do? There was an opportunity, and he took action, didn't he? What did the rest of you guys do? Going crazy lady. I don't know what she's getting at. Crazy lady, crazy lady. Okay, I got a five for 10. Who wants to buy five for 10? Give me $5 for 10. You guys are sleeping. Oh my God, Teddy is my man. Hello? Go back, go back, go back. So what's the difference? He took this opportunity. Now I'll get your attention. Who wants to make $100? Yeah, I, I am so not that crazy. <laughs> I'm, I'm so not that crazy. Back to your seats. I got twins. I got three-year-old twins. I had to pay for them. But anyway, the rest of you guys are all sitting there. And this to me is a prime example of the person that's willing to take action. Now, granted, he's close to the steps, but I would have taken it right here. So if you guys are using that as an excuse, ain't cutting it. So today, I literally want you guys to see this is an opportunity to launch whatever your dream is. My dream was to hold this vision of teenagers being these incredible people with this great time in their life where they really don't have responsibilities so they can do so many cool things, right? Wouldn't we all want to be teenagers again? Wouldn't you do it different? So that is what my program is, Teen Edge, which fits right in to what you guys are doing. And so I am proud. <laughs> And I'm hoping that you guys, I mean, it's, it's great to be your little island and do really cool things, but how cool is it to make your island even bigger and inspire your friends to do great things? And so in a nutshell, that's what my Teen Edge program is. And of course, I would love to talk to you guys about it because that's what I do. I kind of wake people up. It's a no-nonsense, the truth. Because the truth is they have every tool they need. You even as adults have every tool you need to do whatever it is that you want to do. So... With that being said, I love life and I do it every single 